I've just randomly had this burst of energy. And as you can tell, it's late outside. I got this late night burst of energy because I finally got a TV in my room, set up my Xbox. Yeah, the mirror, bad placement, but <laughs> I put the mirror there and it's been up for like, I think since 2021. So it's been put to use and now it's been put to rest. <laughs> So I'm gonna show you how my room's looking. I Did I even explain what I was doing? Basically, I'm gonna be deep cleaning my room because it's a mess. I've been putting off like deep cleaning it because I've been needing to do that. But I kept thinking like, oh, I'm gonna move out soon anyways, but it might not be as soon as I hope. And it's good to be in a kind, what? When your space is clean, it helps your mind, I think. It's good to have a clean space. So that's what I'm gonna try to do. I'm gonna clean my room and my bathroom and my closet. Some drawers I'm not gonna clean, like those ones. I don't care enough to clean them. I'm also not gonna clean those drawers. But these ones, I'm gonna clean. What's good? A point five. <laughs> but yeah, my closet needs help. This was my setup for the makeup tutorial because I had to set my phone up like on top of this because this is the phone stand uh, a dirty plate it's been in there for like been in here for like an hour i swear i'm not the the food type of messy we have work to do i'm gonna start with the bed first because you know i'm not gonna finish this all tonight and i need a place to sleep the floor doesn't look very appetizing actually i have slept on my floor before it's not that bad i just jumped on my sink he's insane so we're starting off by putting things around the tv because all that stuff before used to be all on that dresser and then you can see that I'm getting distracted by Spotify because I've got to have good music to listen to if I'm going to be cleaning. Otherwise, I'm going to get bored. Because cleaning, I will admit, it's... I mean, sometimes it can be fun, but it's not the most fun. So when you're looking forward to good music to listen to, it can give you more motivation to clean. So I'm under a real dilemma here. I don't know what to do with the rest of this stuff. Because most of it was up here. And I put a lot up there. But I just, I'm not entirely sure. Like I have this whole pile of rocks. This whole pile of like cool rocks. And I don't know where to put them. Cause they're cool. And I want to showcase them somehow. Is there a way I can put them on my wall? I'm going to look up rock things. To see if I can put them on my wall or something. Right, Bonnie? Right. I'm going to test something. And if this works... I hope it does. I can scatter them about like this. Here I am about to do the rock scattering. There were a lot of rocks, so honestly, I thought that I was going to be able to put them on top of each door frame, but I had less rocks than I thought, which was honestly kind of disappointing. So I was only able to put them on that mirror and what I'm doing right now, which is putting them above those double doors. I really liked the way that they looked and I was trying to make it so that the big rocks were on the very ends, but that was a lot of effort. So I didn't really do that very well, but there was an attempt made. Well, it's safe to say I found a place for the rocks. Oh, so beautiful. And there those ones are. One top. And this is supposed to be attached to the necklace, but the chain broke. So I'm gonna put it on top of the main door. Because the main door doesn't have any rocks and I feel like it needs something. Oh, I forgot I had seashells. So I'm gonna add the seashells. Oh wait, I keep changing my mind. Isn't, that's so much cooler. It's so much easier to see. Right there. And I'll put the seashells on top of the door. Cause I feel like this door needs something. There's that seashell and that seashell. You know what, this is a great, seat for me to play guitar. I've always had issues like playing the guitar because I never had a good place to sit because my feet would always dangle off the bed or sitting crisscross. Getting a little distracted. This drawing that I made like a year ago, I should redraw it because that would be cool. So Bonnie needs to get out of the chair. I feel like I just cut my lip. This centered. <gasps> I thought it was recording. 
think that's a good place. Back at it again with the stuff on the bed. A lot of things I put in that separate room that you can see that I'm going in. Also, Sparks was put on, and I was not about to cry, so I had to change it. Yeah, a lot of stuff was moved into the other room, which is kind of bad, but it's whatever. So, basically, I've cleaned up my bed enough to sleep on it, but I, I was looking at all the candles that I had up there. But look, <laughs> I actually can't light it. If anyone knows how to fix this, please tell me. I am desperate. I am hungry, so I'm going to put this plate away downstairs, and I might grab a little snack. I think it's funny if I do this in point five. I did get some snacks. I'm gonna take a little break and then continue cleaning. So now I'm just picking up all the stuff that I had laying around there, moving it to their correct, proper placement. So if you're wondering, the snacks were scrumptious. And as you can see, I'm putting my guitar in the guitar case and propping it up on my wall. But the next morning, I actually took it out because it wasn't practical to just always keep it in the case. How am I ever gonna just pick it up randomly and play it? Ran out of tape, so I'm gonna go downstairs to try and find some. I did find tape as well as gum and a Starbucks gift card that I'm not sure if will work. Doing this little decorating segment really made me want to decorate more of my room because there's a lot of empty space. And I was thinking that might take a lot of time. So I think the next video I'm gonna do about my room will be me decorating stuff. I do have lots of ideas for ways I can decorate my room. Also with this specific playbill, it fell off my wall because the tape wasn't strong enough to hold it. So it's almost 12.30 and I started cleaning and 40 not counting, setting the TV up and stuff. And I've definitely made progress. I feel like not enough for two hours, but I also was dilly-dallying to be fair. But I feel like if I stop cleaning now, I'm not going to be in the mood to clean again. Because, you know, late at night, those cleaning moods, they just happen. And I don't want it to go away because I still have a lot I need to do. Because I do have work tomorrow, so I should get a good night's sleep. I'll continue cleaning tomorrow. So as you can see, my bed is missing a few things. Because I took off my bed sheets and the pillowcases and I put them in the wash because it was time like they needed a clean. I'm gonna drink this, chill for a bit, and then I will continue cleaning. I didn't specify what I was drinking, but I was drinking a strawberry banana smoothie with like protein powder and this kind of powder for your gut health or something. And right here you can see I'm organizing all my jewelry because I have a lot of jewelry. And the very top one was where I put the jewelry that I don't really use, but I don't want to get rid of. And then the third one down is my main jewelry that I use. But as you can see, there was just a lot of random stuff in the bottom floor of my closet, especially stuffed animals, because I tend to get a lot of stuffed animals because I think that they're cute and I see them in the store and I'm like, oh my God, I have to get it. And I put them on my bed and then they went to the closet and now they're in a different closet. As you can see here, I'm reorganizing my shorts and my pants on the different shelves. And on the very bottom shelf, I'm putting the pants that I don't typically wear. And on the second to the bottom shelf, I put the pants that I tend to wear more. So a lot of my closet is clean. However, I still have a lot of work to do. And these are all clean clothes and I don't want them to just chill on the floor. Basically, I feel like I made a lot of progress, which is good because I had all my shoes like over in that one section. I just kept getting annoyed. I'm glad that I have a space in there for them now. And my jewelry is organized. And just give myself some time to relax because I have like an hour before I have to go to work. And I want to deal with that laundry basket because I, I really do hate having a messy room, but since I'm cleaning it so deeply, I'm just gonna need to chill. So I'm gonna go relax now. So I'm back from work and I'm pretty tired and I feel gross because where I work makes me smell gross and stuff. I'm gonna just go get my comforter and stuff from the dryer and put it on my bed. And I don't wanna film that. So I'm just letting you know. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, so. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry. I didn't do anything yesterday because I didn't have like work work. I was still busy. And sometimes when you're doing something, you're allowed to be busy and take a day off. Okay, now is a new day. I'm gonna continue cleaning. Then there's that laundry basket and that's annoying to have in my room. There's also a backpack on the floor that I don't like being there. I'm just upset with the way my room looks because I want it to be clean. There's Clyde on the chair. He's just loafed up.
this shot right here was kind of annoying because the camera slowly moved away and you couldn't see what I was doing so I cut most of it off and also whenever I was taking off the clothes with the hanger the bar that was holding the clothes all fell and so all the hangers fell and it was really annoying what I was doing was I was taking all the clothes off the hanger and putting them onto my bed and organizing which clothes I wanted to keep and which ones I didn't it was a long process and I found a lot of clothes that I actually forgot that I owned so it was very interesting. I don't know what to say because I'm just moving clothes. So how's your guys' day been? Have you ate an orange today? Because I haven't but I wish I have. Oranges are really good. I really like cuties. A certain type of orange. Occasionally you'll see me go up to the mirror and hold up a clothing item to see if I still want to keep it or not. One thing that went through my mind was mm, do I want to keep it? You know with the right amount of styling I think I could make it work. So there was a lot of stuff I kept that I don't know if I actually will wear to be honest and then bonnie came into the picture and she's so silly she loves hangers every time i do laundry she will mess with the hangers she just loves attacking them off topic but she also likes attacking my laundry basket and now that i'm saying this i feel like that actually is on topic so i don't know why i said off topic hot topic there's lots of topics i honestly think i could go on and on about nothing well i guess it wouldn't be about nothing but I can just go on and on about the most random stuff. For example, strawberries, they're so cool. Like you can do a lot with a strawberry. You don't even have to eat them. Like if you're so bored, get a strawberry in front of you, you will find a lot of things that you can do with it. You can pick all the seeds out, all the leaves. You can cut it up in all these different ways. You can make a masterpiece out of a singular strawberry. I hope this video gives you motivation to clean your room because it's so nice having a clean room. It honestly does help with your mental state if you are able to clean your room. I definitely recommend it. Even if you just have that one pile of laundry sitting on your chair or in your laundry basket in your room, just clean it. Also, look at Bonnie just looking out the window, watching the birds and stuff. That's so cute. I didn't even notice that until re-watching the footage. It's honestly very satisfying watching the time lapse of me clean. <laughs> I don't know why, but it just is. But now that this is good, I feel a lot better about my room. I still didn't put a backpack away. Um, I'll do that in a second. Okay. <laughs> I work later, so... I'm gonna stop and just let myself chill before I have to go to work. I've made progress today and I'm proud of what I've done. Today is a new day. I don't have a lot of time to clean, but I know one thing's for sure is I gotta vacuum this floor. Cause I'll be walking around barefoot and this is kind of gross, but I'll like feel the crumbs on my feet, especially in that white rug right there. I don't know when the last time my room has gotten vacuumed, but it's been a while, probably over two months at the least. <laughs> But that's changing today, and it'll change from this day forward. So yeah, time to vacuum. You will see me struggling with this. I kept going over the same spot over and over again because it wasn't picking up the crumbs, and it was making the floor all wet, and it was really weird, and I really kept trying to make it work, but it just would not work, and it was very frustrating. I don't even know if this vacuum works. I just found one in the closet, but look what it left. It left this big thing of dust, and if you feel this, it's wet. Why is it wet? I probably shouldn't have touched it. It says Formula Water Max Deep Clean. I just want a normal <laughs> vacuum. Maybe I need to put it on Express Clean. I don't know. I'm gonna try it again, though. So alas, I try again, but this time in point five, which I think is very silly. Um, I'm getting a new vacuum. I can't handle this vacuum. I'm surprised that Bonnie's so chill, though. Like, she's not running away or nothing. Like, she's definitely concerned, but she's not trying to run away. So I guess what I was using was a carpet cleaner, and this should work. Now, how do I use this one? This one's quiet. <laughs> I was very disappointed re-watching this for the first time and realizing that somehow it's not in point five anymore. Also, I'm just not the best at vacuuming. I kept vacuuming the white rug just over and over and over again trying to get all the crumbs out and they just would not come out. Also, I missed a whole section. I don't know how I managed to do that. I'm just not a good vacuumer. I'm sorry. The vacuum died, so basically I'm done vacuuming. But that's all I'm doing for today. This room's done. It's clean. The only thing left I have to do is my bathroom. It's not gonna be fun. 
It's the day we've all been waiting for. Oh, my necklace. Cleaning my bathroom. I actually don't know if anyone was waiting for that. This isn't about cleaning, but it's off topic, I guess. I'm gonna be sick of my hair, like the split of it. I wanna do pink like stripes and then add like tinsel into it. So I used hot water because I just washed it. So it's fading out like decently well. I just want it to fade out now. I also forgot that my hair can naturally get like this wavy. I need to clear this of all the stuff that's going on. But basically, I forgot that my hair could do this. And so it's just interesting to see. Because usually I put my hair in heatless curlers. Or just after the shower, I brush it straight. So I forgot that my hair had this potential. And I'm just really excited for whenever it goes longer. Because when it's longer, the waves whenever it's longer is so pretty and i can definitely tell that it's getting longer because you can see it in my roots you'd have to get close up to see it just because it's not a lot of growth because it's only been like a month i think since i had my hair bleach i've been purposely keeping these washcloths here for the cleaning of it because usually i put it in my laundry I didn't specify what the washcloths were for, but I used them to wash my face, and then after I was done, I just put them on my sink like that. Also, my cats, as you have seen, love to get on my sink, and that causes a lot of cat fur to be on there, and also I brush my hair there, so it's just very annoying to clean. What's up, Bon? Clean the bathroom. I know I said I was gonna clean those drawers, but I don't want to anymore. They're organized enough, so it's okay. But it's clean now. <laughs> Bonnie and Clyde are about a brawl. <laughs> well, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll give a final little tour of what the room looks like. Now, oh, Bonnie. Yeah, there it is. Guess I'll show my closet. There's the closet. Oh, she's stretching, stretching. In the bathroom. I forgot to mention, but that is a new rug. I'm gonna go take a nap now.